I was in Africa on stage preaching, my first time to Africa, and in the meeting, God says, hey, there's a woman here and her daughter is dying in the hospital, but I want you to tell the woman her daughter's already dead. I said, Lord, I can't do that. He goes, you have to, because I'm telling you to do it. Oh. Uh, I said, but Lord, that's not a good way to start a crusade the first night. And he would not let me go. I said, is there a woman here? You're in, you came from the hospital. Your daughter's dying. She raised her hand. That's me. I said, I'm sorry, but the Lord told me to tell you she's already passed. That had to be so hard for you to do. Terrible. I said, that's not the way to start a crusade with miracles. I said, Lord, what do I do now? She's crying. He says, raise her from the dead. But she's not here. She's in a hospital in another city. And he said, but David, you know this. There's no distance in my glory. You've taught this. Yeah, but okay. I said, what direction is the hospital? I pointed to it. I began calling her spirit back in her body. And sure enough, she went back to the hospital and they said, ma'am, your daughter died shortly after you left. But at a certain hour, the hour we were praying, she came back to life. She had a sheet covering her pronounced dead and it freaked out the doctors.